Good morning, everybody. It's Doc Green, the Road Scholar, coming back at you. I'm <clears throat> not sure if y'all are aware, but 5G network is in effect next year. Uh, 3G and below is obsolete, will not work. I mean, it, let me kind of explain that. Uh, your ELD systems, a lot of you guys have ELDs, Omni Tracks, and all these other different kinds out here. People bet all this. A lot of your systems work on what they call a 3G network. Y'all know what that is. You know, we used to use it back when we used the flip phones. And stuff. <laughs> but anyway, a lot of our systems, our ELD systems, use these 3G networks. As of next year, that's obsolete. So your ELD will crash every time. It will look like it's crashing or something. It will look like you unplugged it when it crashes. And DOT is telling us now they're giving you fair warning to get your ELD replaced. So I'm letting y'all know you need to get your ELD replaced. Here's the problem with that. Because of all the shipping thing and everything and the, the uh, supply chain, it's about a six-month wait to get on a, get a new ELD. So, but you guys need to know, you need to go with your company, check to see if you got the, uh, if yours is 3G or 5G, and don't assume because you got it this year, it's a 5G, because you know how companies are, they'll take them out of one truck, stack them up on a shelf, another truck comes in, put them in there, and boom, you're running a 3G system that they've owned for three or four years or something, or maybe even bought this year because 3Gs are still for sale and you have a 3G system that will not work next year and when it shows that you unplugged and that's what it will show that you unplugged out of the system whether you did or not it will it will crash on you and start up there's a whole lot of reasons it will crash on you once because some of the stuff plug them you know when we go in the house or whatever you know we don't leave our computers in the car some people do some people don't you know whatever but I'm just letting you know if it ever shuts off and you power down even power down like we don't normally do next year that will show that you actually unplugged from your truck and DOT will look at that as an unplug and you will be fine and you will be held responsible and they are warning you now they have already put out several websites and everything else they are letting you know 3G's may have these problems may have these issues if so that is no excuse you still will be fine so go ahead and get that uh, system updated checked out and everything remember there's about six months wait on that or something so you may need to get with your company. Make sure you've got plenty of paper logs because uh, if your system goes down, you need to bring it back up and check on it and everything and, and make sure that it kept up with what's going on because sometime next year, it's going to stop. It's not going to be processing up to the satellite systems and everything like that. It's just not. The cell networks and everything, it's just not. So you uh, make sure you've got your paper logs. Remember, you can only read paper logs for about five days. And so far, as of this point, DOT doesn't seem to be wanting to work with the truck drivers at all in this situation, so it looks like we're going to be getting fined for that if it's not working. Get yours on order now. Like I said, they're about six months out. Get with your company. Those of you that have to order through your personal, you know, order your own or whatever, you need to get those ordered because it's going to be bad for you. Anyway, just thought I'd update you guys, let you know ELDs will be crashing and you will be held responsible. Out.